There. Welcome to Research 2013. Thank you for clicking on the link and releasing us from cy cyberspace so we can speak with you here today. I'm Matthew Davis, the Interim Director of Medical Education at SWARP, and joining me here is Stephanie Romano. Your Education Coordinator. So we thought we'd uh, give you guys a bit of a webinar video introduction to this year's uh, online training website and your pre-course package for your research. So obviously you've made it this far, so you're in. Uh, so I thought I'd give you a, a quick overview of your research day. So last year, uh, most of you completed a post-course evaluation where you were able to show us what you wanted to see in future research, and you're getting exactly what you asked for. So you've asked for more case discussions, more hands-on scenarios, and more hands-on skill stations. So you're going to get that in a group setting, very laid back, very stress-free, um, and then in addition to that, a 50 question multiple choice test, much like the one from last year. And most of you found that uh, not too challenging, so hopefully you find it the same this year. So in terms of the layout of how this year's pre-course package looks, so you're going to find modules much like you did last year, where in each module you'll find a webinar, so video presentation, as well as a quiz. You'll also find that we have, uh, we've changed things a little bit, so we've got four mandatory modules, and about eight or nine optional modules. So the reason we did this is because you asked for more challenging topics and you also asked for more dedicated um, education that you could pick and choose what you wanted to learn. So those optional modules are there for you to do that. Again, we have a 72 hour rule, so please complete all of your pre-course mandatory modules no later than 72 hours before your research day. So what are the expectations from you who's completing the, the research course? Well, the first thing is we need you to complete all the mandatory pre-course uh, webinars prior to coming to your research day, and that needs to be done 72 hours before your research day. Also, highly recommend and suggest that you complete the optional modules as well. And the reason for this is that the test is going to be based on all the topics covered in the pre-course material. Yeah, so pay very close attention to what Matt just said. The optional modules are optional, but you will still be tested on the material within those optional modules. So if it's a topic you're not necessarily familiar with or haven't really reviewed recently, uh, we'd highly recommend you go in there, watch the webinars, and attempt the quizzes. Now here's the difference between the quizzes in terms of the mandatory versus optional modules. The mandatory modules, we will need to pass those quizzes within three attempts. Now the pass grade is 80%. Uh, the optional modules, there is no, there's an 80% pass rate, but there's no maximum number of attempts. So you can go in there and try as many times as you want. So if you have any questions during your pre-course work, make sure that you first check Ask Mac. That's a huge database of information, questions, and that, that may answer the question that you have. If you can't find the answers to your questions there, then please contact us through the SWARP website at the Contact Us link. Also, you feel free to contact one of the educators with your question. And if you're having any problems with your internet, the websites, um, just getting access to the, to, to the pre-course materials, then please contact Michelle Frazier and she can help you out with that. Perfect. Thanks for watching and we hope you enjoy your research. Thank you and good luck this year.